If you've ever wondered what a PSD file is, then you're in the right place. In this tutorial, you'll learn exactly what a PSD file is. You may have come across a PSD file once or twice while browsing through Windows Explorer, and frankly, if you don't have Photoshop, these files will be quite useless to you. However, if you do, it is very important you know what they are and how you can utilize them. PSD stands for Adobe Photoshop Document File and can only be edited within Adobe Photoshop. PSD files allow you to save all of the settings within the Photoshop image, including each individual layer. This is extremely useful for re-editing images. The best example of this is where you have an image with a certain text that you'd like to change. This can be difficult to do without at least slightly altering the background of the image, but if you have a PSD, you can just edit the text layer. By default, whenever you save an image in Photoshop, it will save as a PSD unless you specify another image format. If, for whatever reason, this isn't set as the default, you can select .psd from the drop-down menu underneath the file name box when saving the image. You won't be able to save an image as a PSD using any other image editing software, such as Microsoft Paint. A PSD is only used in Photoshop. You also can't convert from another format to PSD without using Photoshop, and there wouldn't really be any point as once the image has been saved as a JPEG, for example, there won't be any layering. You can convert a PSD to a JPEG or any other format, either with Photoshop or an online tool. However, you will lose any layers that were previously saved on that PSD, and converting it back to a PSD won't bring these layers back, so be sure you do keep a backup of the PSD if you wish to do any more editing with the layers intact. You now have a basic idea of what is a PSD file and what it can be used for.